It's okay. It's okay. Get out of had a bad dream. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Look, 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 What's going on? Martha, why are you pointing a knife at me? Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I confiscated it from Bruce last week. I just must have kept on to it. You know how I feel about him playing with knives. Uh, where is Bruce? Oh my god. Is he sleeping? Did I wake him? Please, God, don't make me say this again. He's with Alfred, right? I figured. Oh my God, you're bleeding. What happened? It's okay. It's, it's all right. You had another nightmare. I'm so sorry. It's fine. No. It's fine. It's fine. No, I'll make it I'll up to fine. you. Thomas? Yeah. Maybe we shouldn't go out tonight. Maybe we should just stay in. We could give Alfred the night off, and I could cook. It could be just the three of us. We could have a nice family night. Won't that be nice? Martha, listen to me. Bruce is gone. Gone? No. No, he's probably down at that damn cavern again. And I told you we need to cover that thing. He could fall through it, you know? Martha, our son is dead. Is this some sort of joke? Thomas. Thomas, tell me this is some sort of joke. I'm so sorry. No. No. No, 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 no. Some morning tea, ma'am. And how are we feeling today? Did Thomas call the exterminator yet? The exterminator, ma'am? The bats. Bruce found a nest in that damn cave the other day. And they nearly scared him half to death. Why, yes, the infestation has been taken care of. Good. Those damn things gave him nightmares, you know. For a whole week, he's just been a wreck. I've never seen Bruce so stressed before. Thomas wants to take him to a movie tonight. But I don't think it's a good idea. I think we should just stay home, you know? I'm going to tell Thomas when he gets home later. What do you think? You think that's a good idea? Of course, ma'am. I've poured you some tea. Would you care for anything else? No. Thank you, Alfred. Could you check on Bruce for me? As you wish. Not well, sir. May I offer a suggestion? Of course. Miss Wayne is in dire need of expert care, sir. Care that I'm afraid neither of us can provide. I'm aware. There's no shame in asking for help, sir. I will. Tomorrow. Tomorrow, uh, I'll make the call. 
I promise. And for today. Today is Bruce's birthday. I want her to spend it here. With him. Of course. Hey, hon. How you doing? I'm fine. Why do you ask? I brought you a gift. A gift? What kind of gift? I found him. I know his name. Whose name? Joe Chill. Joe Chill? Who is that? He's the I'm... man who took our son away. I found him and I'm going to make this right, I promise. I promise you're scaring me. What are you talking about? Damn it, you know exactly what I'm talking about. How many times do we have to go over this? Thomas, you're hurting me. <sighs> Bruce is dead! No. No, why are you saying that? Because Joe Chill took a gun and he shot him through the heart. He died in our hands, Martha. You're dying. He's dead. Bruce is dead! Stop it! But I'm gonna get right. I know who Joe Chill is. I'm gonna make it right. I promise. Get away from me! I just want to see you smile again. I just want you to be happy again. Leave me alone! <laughs> I'm gonna make this right. I promise. I'll be back soon. Just stay here. Okay. I love you. Change my mind. I want to go out tonight.
Is everything all right? I heard a shout. Alfred, where are my pearls? Thomas and I are going out tonight. I want to wear them. Your pearls, ma'am? Yes, my pearls. Where are they? Map your face. What did you do? My pearls, Alfred. Where are they? I'm going to call Master Thomas. Oh! What have you done? I kept asking him, and asking him, and asking him. I was very polite. He would not find my pearls. Your face. Do you like it, Tom? Mm -hmm. Did it feel? Really... Now I'm smiling. <laughs> now I'm always smiling. 